sudden, to the entrance of the stadium, the streets were one long stream of color. Green flagpoles bearing a scarlet banner with a swastika in the center were spaced every 50 feet. And at the entrance were the massed flags of 52 nations participating in the game. Through these flag-bedecked streets, the giant Hindenburg points the way to the arena. A runner with a flaming torch, which was lighted in Athens, birthplace of the Olympic Games, arrives at the Lust Garden to be saluted. From the archway of the Marathon Gate enters the athletes of 52 nations, led by the Greeks, as is their right for having originated the Games. A champion of the 96 Olympiad walks in the costume of ancient Greece. The others follow in alphabetical order, with the French receiving the biggest applause. Great Britain receives a great ovation as they pass the dial. The Italians also received a rousing reception as they passed in review. Then came the boys and girls of the USA, 400 strong, second only to Germany in numbers. They received a cordial, if not overwhelming, welcome when their massive columns appeared. But just as their head arrived at the dais, the German contingent came into sight at the Marathon Gate. Immediately, the band stopped the march it was playing and broke into Deutschland über alles. The audience, rising promptly, froze into silent attention so that the Americans marched not to applause but to the German national anthem.